Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do a different video. We have got a toucan box that came through the post so we are going to unbox it and do the craft for you and show you what's inside, aren't we? Yeah. So without further ado we will show you what came inside Izzy's toucan box. So the toucan box is great. I saw this on Instagram um, where I follow, I start following them and you could get a free box so I took them up on the offer as Izzy loves crafts. These are aimed at three to eight year olds and I chose this one as it's the perfect size to go through your purse box. I think it's the petite box and we are signed up to get another one next month. Um, and like I said, it's just a great little size. If you're not in, you don't have to wait around. It comes personalised with your child's name on. And this box is normally £5.97, I believe. But you can have them sent fortnightly or monthly. And I just thought it'd be something nice for us to do. I think this one is a Christmas theme box. So we will see what is inside. So shall we open it? Yeah. You manage. So when you open the box it looks like this and it says hello Izzy can you hear the sleigh bells Christmas is almost here and so it's time to get decorating to add a little bit of crafty magic to your home let's make some beautiful beaded ornaments hang them up and share that festive feeling. And it says, share with friends, treat your friends to their first toucan box for free and earn yourself 50% off for each friend that signs up. Just peel off your stickers that contain the personal codes and pop them on your share with friends leaflets. But I will put our codes in the description box for yourselves to use. And then you can reuse your box. You can make a picture frame out of it, which is quite nice for recycling. So we get a sticker, then it says let's get making beaded ornaments and it's got how much grown up assistance your child will need, messiness and no drying time needed and it says what you will need so everything comes in this box for what you need. And it says, the learning focus of this task is to build fine motor strength by threading the beads onto the pipe cleaners. Encourage your child to use a pincer grip, the thumb and first two fingers to manipulate the beads. Building strength in these fingers helps with pencil control when writing. So that's the physical development and we can make three of the candy canes and one of the snowflakes. And there's the instructions. And then it just says, let's go on a festive adventure. And it's like a little Christmas themed activity book. And we just, diff oh, we can make squashy reindeers. They look cool, don't they? It's a little recipe inside and just Christmassy activities. And then it says, official member of the Toucan Box Craft Club. Coming in your next box, free prize chart to collect your stickers on. So that must be what these little stickers are for. You must collect them for something. Another fantastic craft project. A new to to canoe sticker. Save your sticker to add to your chart. An adventurous theme to explore in your next box. Then it's a gift for friends for your unique code. Then it says for the grown up assistant so we'll see what's in here and it's just basically leaflets a graze leaflet a wine leaflet joe browns and culture vulture direct <laughs> and then these are what we need so you get some pipe cleaners some blue beads some red beads some like string oh, look at them ones and then like white bead so shall we get started yeah so put all these to one side don't want to lose your sticker just move the box so I'll just, I'll put them on the table up there so what we need to do 
need to get a pipe cleaner. It says number one, thread three red beads onto one pipe cleaner. So there's pipe cleaners. Yeah, so we need to open them and get that we need to find the red beads. These are the red beads. I'll open the beads. Mm-hmm. The beads, yeah. The beads look a bit like fidget spinners. I know, they look like... Maybe we're best, because I don't want to get beads everywhere, so she'll just tip a few onto here. Yeah. Get your pipe... What's it say? Thread three onto one pipe cleaner. Make a small loop at the ends to keep the beads in place. So one of the ends, we just need to make, a like, little. a little... No. Yeah, like a loop. Like that look. And then we need to thread three of these onto the pipe cleaner. Then it says, once you've added three red, we have to add three clear. And then you keep adding them in sets of three until you... So you do three clear. Yeah. Uh, I can't these ones. Yeah. Oh no, know. they look different, don't they? Yeah. Because they look like this different one. They look see these, these ones look nice. I think they're all for the snowflake. snowflakes. Yeah, because look, they've got like, I think they feel like the um, makeup. Then, she yeah. makes three snowflakes, don't you? Oh, yeah. That's open. So you need three of them. Three of them. Put on. And then oh, you just keep oh. going. <laughs> box a try as Izzy really loves crafting and I just like something nice to do and kids are always excited to get post and it just comes with everything that you need you can get different ones as well I think some of the bigger ones come with like books and stuff but you have to obviously if you're not in then you have to go collect parcels and stuff so we, mm. we just thought that you could get this one and it comes through the post so and in the letter box if you've used two boxes before do let me know in the comments below what you think of them if you've enjoyed them or if you've got any other crafty ideas or if you want to see us do more craft together then we would love to hear from you we always love hearing from our subscribers <laughs> A candy cane shape. And there you have it. Well done. Did you enjoy making that? Yeah. And then you can go hang them on your tree at Christmas. So I get like I guess these fall and then time around. No, that them? one's for that snowflake oh. one. Look. So what do you want to do now? Should we try and make the snowflake to show people? So now we're going to make the snowflake, which is the second activity in the box. So we have twisted our three pipe cleaners to make a six pointed star. So now we have to thread each of the arms with blue and white beads, three of each colour. Add one star bead onto each arm, which is these ones. So off you go. So you do like... Is it white first or blue? Whichever. Uh, one, two, three, then three of these. No, they've put theirs on. Oh, well, it don't matter, I don't think. You can put them anywhere, I think. Because they've got them all at different points. Look. I just want to hold you I just want to look into your eyes And tell you that I want you You know you make me feel so alive Can't stop thinking about you day and night Love it when you kiss me Love it when we touch Every time I'm down, yeah, you make me smile
snowflake for hanging up and we still had some red beads left over from the candy canes as well I mean Izzy is on the upper limit for the two come boxes as she's eight now and she'll be nine next month but I don't think that really like matters like it just says three to eight but like this activity she's really enjoyed doing so we'll see what we get next month and we'll decide from there because i think just for five pound 97 that you get all the stuff and to do a craft like this at home it'd probably cost more than that to do and like in the book you get a recipe and some activities and I just think it's something nice to do on like a rainy, to keep it for a rainy afternoon or a rainy day. And yeah, we've really enjoyed it, haven't we? Yeah. I think Thomas, our oldest, would be bored. Um, but is he's, he's more into drawing rather than like crafting and making. But I know this like suggests do three blue and then three clear for the snowflake, but you could do like alternate or just whatever pattern you like. You could go crazy. But I do really like these beads. I've not seen any like this before. They're like little like fidget spinners as easy calls them. Like, and I think they look really pretty when you hang it on your Christmas tree and the lights catch it. I just want to look into your eyes You know you make me feel like I'm alive instructions and if you wanted to make these again like the next year then you could go find some products and make them again which is good because it tells you what you need for the activity Christmas can hang it up in our tree. Mm-hmm. There's just two there, babes. Oh. Babes. There's just two there. Oh. Mm -hmm. I thought I was missing one. Mm. Hey, why? Edward's very happy eating his lunch. That didn't even go on. Mm. Do you want me to help you? Yeah. Do you want me to hold the stock? The snowflake branch. And I'll do one like more. Oh, you didn't thread on that what? one. What's wrong with that? Oh, it's broke that one. That one's a bit deformed. I'll just have this one instead. Let's see now. Mm. It's like a pair of headphones. Mm. This is a fiddly one. Could have made less, on it? Well, there we go. Right. Now that is, I think, done. 
Just need to tell them we're done. Yeah, it's all done. Subscribers, Obviously, comment you, down you, below which one's your favourite candy cane. We'll trim the string, but you could have it like looped. That's very good. Do you like that? Yep. And these are the other candy canes which we did. Comment down which is your favourite. So, yes, there you have our beaded ornaments for Christmas from our toucan box. If you like this video, please do give it a big fat thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more videos. Um, I have actually decided that rather than the three uploads a week, I'm going to have to commit to just two at the minute, just a Monday and a Friday, just because I have gone back to work work after maternity leave and it was really hard to keep up with all the great content three times a week so I'm going to commit to two but if I do have time to do three and I have some great content to put out there one week then you maybe get three one week and um, but I hope you all do appreciate it and do stick around and um, I've loved all the new subscribers showing my channel some love so thank you ever so much and we will see you next time guys bye, bye.